That's a highly good question. Your brachial plexi system is going to be the most complex system of plexis in all of the peripheral nervous system. It's going to be more complex than your cervical plexis, more complex than your lumbosacral plexis. Your brachial plexis are going to be needed to be broken down in a much more categorically and systematically correct manner. So what I do is I first go ahead and break that down in four different categories. That's going to be RTDC, which is going to be roots, trunks, divisions, and cords. Your brachial plexus is going to be rooted from C5 through T1 on the cervical thoracic region. Next, I look at it spherically and notice that there's going to be a need for an upper trunk, median trunk, and a lower trunk, all of which are going to have anterior-posterior divisions on it. Those anterior-posterior divisions are going to go deep through the clavicle, enter in through the axilla, go around the axillary artery, and connect back into a cord bundle, of which you're going to have three different cord bundles. They're going to be either median, posterior, or lateral, all going in the counterclockwise direction. Five major nerves you're going to have to know and master. That's going to be your axillary nerve, your musculocutaneous nerve, your median nerve, your ulnar nerve, your radial nerve, and these are all going to innervate in different regions of the body. Your posterior cord is going to be innervated by the axillary nerve and the radial nerve. Your axillary nerve is going to innervate your teres minor muscle and the deltoid muscle, and your radial nerve is going to innervate all of the posterior end of your lateral extremity. Now, next, the median cord. That's going to be innervated by your median nerve, which is going to innervate all of the forearm distal down to the fore lateral arm. And then next, you're going to have your ulnar nerve, which is going to innervate the flexis carpi and the median portion of the flexis digitorum profundus. Next, on your lateral cord, you're going to have your musculocutaneous nerve, which is going to innervate into the biceps brachii and the brachialis proximal from your lateral forearm. Little way.